Hey guys, welcome to Striker Bites. While working on another video this afternoon, I noticed that the team behind Portainer released an update to the software. This new 2.9.1 update includes a new dark mode to make the application easier on your eyes. I wanted to make a quick video to show you how to update your Portainer container in order to enable the new dark mode. First log in to your Docker host in your favorite terminal application. Type in docker ps to view a list of running containers on your system. We need to find the name of our Portainer container. On my system, as you can see it is called Portainer1. First, we need to stop the container. Type in docker stop Portainer1. Remember to replace Portainer1 with the name of your Portainer Docker container. Now we will remove the Portainer Docker container from the system. Type in docker rm Portainer1 to remove the container. Now we will verify that the container is deleted. Next we will pull the latest version of Portainer by typing in docker pull Portainer slash Portainer hyphen CE. Once downloaded, it is time to recreate the Portainer Docker container on your system using the new container image. To do this, type in the standard Portainer run command from their website. Don't worry, I made sure to include it in the video description so you can copy and paste. To verify the new container is running type in docker ps and you should see it in your list of running docker containers. That's it. Now we can log in to our Portainer installation. We can verify that we are running the latest version, 2.9.1. Now, to switch to dark mode, click on, my account, in the top right hand corner of the screen. Scroll to the bottom. Click on Dark Theme and click Update Theme. Now you are using the new Dark Mode feature in Portainer. As you can see it is much easier on your eyes. You can switch back anytime by visiting the My Account screen. That's it for this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them in the, the comments section below. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe.